Is it the right time to buy or sell the TQQQ ETF? In this video, we'll be delving deep into the TQQQ. We initially published a report on our website on Friday, November 10, 2023. And now, we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. Keeping up with crucial updates that could impact your investments is essential. Improve your trading decisions by trying out our newly launched AI stock analysis tool, powered by GPT-4, at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one of the 25,000 companies worldwide. Please remember that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since November 2, 2023, our system has identified TQQQ as a buy candidate, with a score of 4.54. Now, let's dive into the stock's performance during this period. Investors who followed our analysis would have experienced a remarkable gain of 12.31% since we first recommended TQQQ as a buy candidate seven days ago. This translates to an average daily return of 1.76% since it was listed as a buy candidate. Based on the current three-month trend, it appears that there could be a potential minus 10.10% change in the next three months. This suggests a possible return ranging from minus 33.68% to minus 10.10%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it indicates an 83.03% change over the next year. This suggests a potential return between 43.41% and 143.78%. In terms of price, this could mean a range of $58.47 to $99.39 after one year. Our latest update for TQQQ brings exciting news. On Friday, the TQQQ ETF price experienced an impressive gain of 6.67%. Specifically, on the last trading day, Friday, November 10, 2023, the TQQQ ETF price rose from $38.22 to $40.77. Throughout the day, the ETF fluctuated by 5.83%, reaching a low of $38.58 and a high of $40.83. It's worth noting that the price has been on an upward trend, rising in 9 out of the last 10 days and showing a remarkable 30.26% increase over the past two weeks. Additionally, the volume of shares traded decreased by 4 million on the last day, with a total of 123 million shares bought and sold, amounting to approximately $5.03 billion. It's important to consider that a decrease in volume on higher prices may indicate divergence and could serve as an early warning for potential changes in the coming days. Looking at the bigger picture, over the past 52 weeks, the TQQQ ETF reached a highest price of $47.14 and a lowest price of $16.10. Currently, the price is 13.51%, equivalent to $6.37, below the 52-week high, and a significant 78.64%, equal to $150.11, below its all-time high on January 8, 2021, when it reached $190.88. Let's take a look at the signals for TQQQ today. The chart shows mostly positive signals for the TQQQ ETF. Both the short and long-term moving averages indicate a buy signal, suggesting a positive forecast for the stock. Additionally, there is a general buy signal when the short-term average is above the long-term average. In case of any downward corrections, there is support from the lines at $38.44 and $36.15. However, if the stock breaks below these levels, sell signals may be issued. On Thursday, October 26, 2023, a buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point, resulting in a 32.11% increase so far. It is expected to rise further until a new top pivot is found. Furthermore, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, also indicates a buy signal. It's worth noting that the volume decreased during the last trading day despite the price gain. This creates a divergence between volume and price, which could be an early warning. Therefore, it is important to closely monitor the ETF. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. One signal to consider is the moving average convergence divergence, which has shown a buy signal. 
Another signal to look at is pivots, which also generated a buy signal 12 days ago. Bollinger is another indicator that showed a buy signal 12 days ago. The short-term moving average indicates a buy signal 9 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average also indicates a buy signal 8 days ago. Additionally, the relationship between the short and long moving averages indicated a buy signal 4 days ago. If we examine the 12-month chart, we can observe the following. The short moving average displayed a buy signal 8 days ago. The long-term moving average also generated a buy signal 2 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages indicated a buy signal 30 days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us for more signals. Today, we'll be discussing support, risk, and stop loss for TQQQ. Let's start with support. TQQQ has found support from accumulated volume at $39.15. This level presents a potential buying opportunity as we can expect an upward reaction when the support is tested. However, it's important to note that TQQQ is considered a high-risk ETF. It experiences significant volatility throughout the day, which means its price can fluctuate greatly. In fact, just yesterday, the ETF had a price range of $2.25, or 5.83%, between its high and low points. And over the past week, it has shown an average daily volatility of 3.77%. Today, we're going to dive into some potential day trading levels for TQQQ. If the market is experiencing an upward trend, the first resistance level for TQQQ is at $40.94. If you don't currently own any shares, it might be wise to wait for the stock to surpass this level before considering a position. For those who are already holding TQQQ, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading. On the other hand, if TQQQ is facing a downward trend, it encounters its first support level at $39.15. If this support level holds, it could present a good entry point for traders anticipating a rebound. Our recommended stop loss for this ETF is set at $39.50, which is a decrease of 3.12%. It's important to note that this ETF experiences high daily movements, resulting in a higher level of risk. We have identified a buy signal from a pivot bottom that was detected 11 days ago. Is the TQQQ ETF a good investment? Despite the ETF being in a falling trend, there are several positive short-term signals. This indicates that there may be a buying opportunity at the current level and a fair chance for the ETF to perform well in the short term. As a result, we have upgraded our analysis conclusion from a hold slash accumulate to a buy candidate. Our systems have analyzed the volatility and movements of the ETF on the last trading day and found that the current price is overvalued. For Monday, November 13th, we expect the TQQQ ETF to open down $0.710 and start trading at $40.06. Before we begin, it's important to remember that trading comes with a high risk of losing money. It is recommended that you consult a financial advisor before making any decisions to buy or sell securities. Please note that stockinvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing this information, you agree to take full responsibility for your own investment decisions. Welcome to Stock Invest. Today, we're taking a closer look at the current view of the stock. We want to hear your thoughts too so don't forget to comment below and share your opinion. What's your target for the ETF? Let's discuss it together. Remember to like and subscribe to our channel for more valuable insights. Our team wishes you successful trading and a beautiful day. Thank you for being a part of the Stock Invest community.